Hello, my name is Maria, and I just wanted to make another video, and I wanted to elaborate on why I am so attracted to a, and love the idea of self-love and self-healing, self-love, and really, um, really why I am so into um, love and in love with the idea of me really loving myself and other people really loving themselves and embracing that inner love, that inner joy within our own hearts. I um, So I already mentioned earlier in a different video that from the ages of nine and a half to 14 years old, I experienced a lot, a lot of darkness um, in the form of a lot of abuse. And um, that, of course, has led me to even be more attracted to love and light and doing inner work in oneself, um, you know, embracing, be, becoming aware of the wounds you have, we have, the wounds I have, and embracing them with love and light, and just loving, just loving them, and um, slowly but surely bringing them in each one to the light, and um, then having those wounds transform. Um, and yeah, so the reason for all of this, <laughs> um, I kind of lost my train of thought, but it's okay. It, whatever's coming out is fine. Whatever, whatever I'm saying is meant to be said, so it's all good. Um, so the, um, the reason, um, for me just being so into love and light is um, in part because I experienced um, living with someone from nine and a half years old to 14 years old that really hated themselves and just for the most part just spewed hatred to the people around 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 him um, and so I got to experience that and um, and I got to experience um, my whole family falling apart, like the whole family um, dynamic um, just completely, completely fall apart. And um, after that happened, I really got into questioning, which is really, I started on this journey of really questioning why did things fall apart? What, um, what was it inside my parents, um, in their belief system? What was it in their belief system, in their thoughts, in their, um, feelings, um, what they had learned as small children that, um, affected why things fell apart in, our, my family when I was little um, and I really got to question it I got to um, and I realized you know like for example the religion that I um, learned from my parents was a religion that did not serve me at all no did not teach me self-love at all it, it actually taught the opposite of self-love um, and you know, just by really questioning and becoming aware of that, of um, just really questioning, okay, my parents taught me this religion. Does it really serve me? Does it ring true to my heart and my soul? Um, or is, does it not ring true to me? And it's fine. And it's fine if it rings. If I, it's fine if the religion or spirituality that your parents teach you rings true to your heart. That's fine. Um, but if it doesn't, like in my case, I decided to let it go. And by letting it go...
go, it totally freed me up. It totally freed me up to and expanded my mind um, and my heart to other ways, other paths of spirituality, other just other paths of other ways of believing. Um, and yeah, I just because I started questioning so much. And another reason, um, another thing happened too, because my family dynamic when I was small just all fell apart. It, um, just really, you know, got, I, my life got turned upside down, our whole lives got turned upside down in my family. I ended up being so interested in psychology. And I know this rings true to a lot of people that get that become interested in psychology. Um, I just completely became interested in psychology. And um, last senior year in high school, I took psychology, fell in love with psychology, and um, then went on um, to uh, college and I majored in psychology. And, um, and I'm still intrigued by psychology. It's amazing. And it just opened up my mind to like, why do we do the things we do? Why do we have certain behaviors and um, act out certain things in life? And yeah, so anyways, um, I guess that's what I wanted to say. I really wanted to um, just point out I guess um, that my experience of all things falling apart, I really started questioning everything and that made me, um, in a way it freed me so much, in a, in a way it freed me to follow my own truth, follow my own beliefs, follow my own um, inner guidance go within myself and really follow my inner, my inner, inner self and not, not believe what other people outside of me necessarily are saying or doing, but just really listening within and going within and knowing what, um, rings true to my heart. And yeah, so I hope this was helpful for everyone and I send Many blessings, many blessings and love to everybody. Some love, 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 light and laughter <laughs> to all the beings, all beings on this planet. Thank you.